Maki Zuning is a character in the manga and anime Jujutsu Kaisen. She's characterized by her resilience, confidence, and strength. On top of that, Maki has an incredible lean, muscular physique that is showcased especially in the manga. In this video, I'm going to be breaking down how you can look like Maki by going over some training tips, diet, and more. Alright, so getting straight into it, I'm going to go over some different training tips, but first, let's break down Maki's physique and musculature. Some of her strong points or muscle groups that stand out appear to be her shoulders, arms, and core. She also looks to have a well-developed back as she has almost this hourglass type figure. So these are groups that you can put a bit more emphasis and focus on, though you don't necessarily have to. Make sure that you are consistent with a training split that spans at least three days a week. I'd recommend anywhere from three to six days a week, and that you try to hit each muscle group twice a week. On top of that, make sure you are training with high intensity, taking at least one of your sets of an exercise to failure. I want to note that I won't be going into specific training programs in this video, but here are a few splits for the amount of training days you might have. I also won't be going over many specific exercises, but here is a list of five exercises you should include in your routine. Some type of pressing movement, pull-ups, shoulder press, bicep curls, and a squatting movement. If you are curious about some exercises that you can do at home, check out my previous video where I go over how you can build muscle at home. Also, you should incorporate some form of cardio at least two times a week, as Maki is not only muscular, but she's also lean. Which leads us into the next section, diet. In order to achieve Maki's physique, you need to build enough muscle and also become lean. You can do this with stages of being in a caloric surplus and caloric deficit, or in simpler terms, bulking and cutting. Now, if you are a complete beginner or close to it, you may fall into one of the three following categories, skinny, overweight, or skinny fat. If you are skinny, you should calculate your maintenance calories and add 200 to 400 to that each day. If you are overweight, you do the opposite and subtract 200 to 400 from your maintenance each day. If you are skinny fat, I recommend that you also add 200 to 400 to your maintenance each day to put on enough muscle so that later you can cut down the fat and retain the muscle. Make sure that you get around 0.8 to 1 gram of protein per pound of body weight a day and that you eat as clean as possible. And I say as clean as possible because I know that not everyone is in the ideal situation to where they can make sure that they're only eating clean. If you are young and still living with your parents as I am, I get that most of the time you'll have to eat whatever your parents make. Just try to focus on getting a good amount of protein in and eating more or eating less depending on where you're at. To note really quick, unfortunately you may not look exactly like Maki. Everyone has different genetics, so your muscle insertions may not look exactly like hers. But don't let that stop you from wanting to and working to achieve a physique like hers. Hey, even strive to build a better one. Alright, I hope these tips help you to understand how you can achieve Maki Zinning's physique or at least close to it. Just remember to always train hard and eat appropriately. Also, remember that it's going to take time. Building a physique like hers does not happen overnight, so don't give up and keep working. Thank you so much for watching this video. Consider liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next one.